Holy crap, it's time for the finalist of final battles. Truly the end this time, probably, maybe. I don't know what else they could possibly have to wrap up, really, unless they're gonna pull a big ol' swerve. But I guess we'll see. As far as I can tell, this is probably gonna be the last video. And so, if so, uh, thank you for watching along with this, uh, this weird little ride. Uh, yeah, the team has split up. They're going to go collect keys. They're going to come back, and they're going to turn the keys at the same time with the power of friendship. And then their friendship will overcome Mike and save the world, probably. Uh, also, Rachel like grew a personality out of nowhere so he's he's back kind of he's unconscious and yuki is a part of mike michelle i guess we could call her i don't know just a, a part of mike that decided uh actually i want to be friends and so she did and that's been the whole thing i <laughs> yeah uh, a lot of, a lot of stuff happened in that last one Let's go ahead. Let's go. Oh, and we all sang at Rachel. Way, right? Don't forget the part where we all sang at Rachel until he uh, developed feelings. Yeah, seems like it. Well, I say we all, but the game has firmly established that I am a separate character from all of these people. Unless the first person narrator is, in fact, Kotaru Uchikoshi. I'll shut up now. Mochan. Don't get lost, okay? Don't worry. Even if I get lost, all I have to do is follow your scent, Yoro, and I'll be right back with you. Uh, ew. Don't be so gross, all right? So this is what love is, huh? No, she she wears really strong perfume. No! <laughs> Jenny time. Let's leave it to Jenny. What? Ooh ah. Can I? Tall robots are nothing against uh, anti gravity. <laughs> what do I do? If I could somehow lure it over here. Hmm. What should I do? Come along, Tall Robot 2. Tall Robot 3, really. Ah. Uh, take these two instead! It doesn't want them. We're almost out of stickers. Like Dr. Skunk. That that seems like one of the final villains right there. One of the final bosses of Electro Rangers. High-ranking monster who controls people it injects with its syringe gun for three minutes and three minutes only. People under its control are only capable of farting. Skilled at collecting people's farts and using them to make poison bombs. Okay. Moving on. Mochan, I found your favorite Electro Ranger villain. All right, Jenny Tat or not Yoro time, excuse me. She's got it from here. Can I? I d do I remember that thing Mike said? Yep, I I do remember that. But... Right. Those were real life robots for sure. Mm. Crap. Uh, that looks like a puzzle. Okay. Let's 
destroy the puzzle blocks that make up the block puzzle. Your bombs automatically walk away, stand in front of the one you want to destroy and press the button. Then press the switch to activate the current, and if I incorrect them, if I arrange them incorrectly, the puzzle will be reset. Okay. I think I see what's going on. I'm supposed to connect it to the middle one here. Okay, let's just uh, let's just restart this. Let's hit the action button and not the bomb button. Please don't tell me the solution. Let me let me try it. Ah, damn it! I was a little off. Now it's gonna tell me I, I need to connect it to the middle. There we go. This is a s situation that can only be solved with bombs. You're, why did you make the sticker noise? You're not a sticker. <laughs> I'm sorry, I mean, oh no. Are you okay, Nuro? Yeah, somehow. What? What did you do to my precious Nuro? Mochan! Well, Mochon's got murder on the brain. I've got no choice but to... Apparently, it's not turned into a ball because he, he got crushed anyway. I guess just keep jumping. Mega Man. This would this would be about where uh, they put one of those guys with the big shields that you uh, can only shoot from behind. It would be one of these levels. They did that a lot in like four and five. Oh, apparently that guy is really going for it. Am I gonna? Of course, I'm gonna have to do this whole thing again. All right. Well, now I know better, I guess. Not really sure how I'm gonna get out of the way. I 
guess we'll see. Okay. Okay, he, he, he took care of it on his own. Uh, that's acceptable. Oh, wow. All right. I'm going to prove I'm a tough guy for real. Super brave and fearless hero. Nope. Got started a little too late on that one. Please don't make me do the whole little maze again. Okay. Okay. So uh, it does. It does. Uh, it does stop your rolling if you turn it off. However, there is a there is a period where you can no longer use it again. About two seconds. Let's try to not need to do that. Three. Yeah. There we go. One team complete. Team Rock, I think it was? I don't really remember. I'm sorry. That was you. Okay. This is nice. Sticker? No stickers? Okay. Only one sticker per team, probably. This, this would not be out of place in Mist. Okay, I obtained console key at red. Yay! Yes, got the key. I sure did. Red key, one of three keys required to destroy the firewall. Here you go! Look at you go, Mochan! You look so cool back there, Mochan! Murder more people for me next time. My heart totally skipped a beat. I love seeing you just covered in the blood of my enemies. Thanks, Tee -hee. I don't want your thanks. But instead, could you give my belly a poke? Ew. Huh? I did it for me before. I can't forget how good it felt. Ew. Go on, Yoro. Do him a favor. Why's it gotta be me? Oh. Fine. I'll do it. Here goes. And just a little poke, okay? <laughs> so this is what love is, huh? What it, Janu? <laughs> well, that was weird. Hey, are you really sure this is the way? No doubt about it. Thank God we're not on that other team. Let's just keep going. Okay, Pi and Aniki are gonna get shit done. Hey. There are drones flying about. Uh, oh. cannot go that way. But she'll protect us with her barrier. Worked better than I really expected it to. All right. 
Okay, I'm gonna want to do this, but a little bit closer. Like over here. Oh, that's a noise. I swear this is just a Mega Man level. <laughs> Yeah! Defense is offense! See, I could get behind the whole game being like this. Alright, now the ultimate offense is also becoming the best defense. Honesty, are you okay? Why, they're perfect for each other. Yeah. Don't worry. It's nothing. You gotta stay back, right? And how will Earthshaker Microquaker help us out here? Whoops. I forgot there's a buildup. We try that again. Okay, that's pretty satisfying. Now I just need to wait this out a little bit. Do pant pant. I'm tired. <laughs> Pushing. Only losers like Rachel and Pochi need to push things. The Iron Marshal! The I- er, nope. The Iron Marshal appears to be the final boss. High-ranking fiend and faithful servant to a mighty demon king. Headbutts foes with its hardened iron head. Can't see while charging, so it gets flustered when people evade its attacks. Also attacks by transforming its arms into swords. Yeah, that sounds pretty effective. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't... I haven't zoomed in on uh, the Iron Marshal or Dr. Skunk. I'm so bad at this. Oh, Dr. Skunk, you and your farts. Alright, are we gonna see the bomb machine over here? This should do it. <laughs> That's convenient. Yay! Oh, hey. Yeah. Yeah. He's just up ahead. Let's go.
Uh, which one are we gonna get? Green? Probably green. Alright, please don't say anything weird. Blue, of course. So much. You saved me at Shirakawago. Plus, what I did, I did for myself too. Huh? Oh yeah. A actually, I, I. How do I say it? Uh, huh? I don't really like you like at all <laughs> there's an angel singing here too uh, oh you're right we're beneath the sea this is heaven after all Okay, that was fine. Quit dawdling, dum dum and ugly. I'm not a dum dum. I'm not ugly. Wrong way. Dum dum. Ugly. The other way round. Whatever. Let's get going. If we don't hurry, poor Yuki's gonna. hung up on Yuki, huh? I should have killed her when I had the chance. Oh, Karamucho time. And a drop, yep. I don't... It's weak to fire because it's a plant. Makes sense. Let's try and get this one before it runs out. Okay, it's the final sticker. What's it gonna be? Oh, it's Harumi Izumi, of course. The best character, of course. Harumi Izumi. <laughs> Complete! Parmichan's alter ego. Timid but brilliant 15-year-old high schooler. Looks up, to the vi <clears throat> looks up to the confident, vibrant Parmichan, even though they're one and the same person. Okay. Well, that's it. All the stickers have been collected. That wasn't hard at all, turns out. So that's... I, I, I thought it was going to be a thing. It wasn't a thing. Like, at most, it, there was just, like, one a little bit to the left of the screen, and you had to... <laughs> you had to go a little out of your way, just a little teensy bit. Mm-hmm. We did it. Now there's only a tiny chance we'll impale ourselves to death. Well... That didn't seem like that should hit- should have hit, but sure. Huh? 
There we go. Go away. <laughs> I also possess the power of pushing. All right. Ah, Tatsun time. Well, I'm sorry I was trying to take a drink. I'm so sorry. Electric attacks don't work. Run, Tatsun! Found it. I wasn't just running away. I figured out your weak spot. Is just as I planned. Whatever. <laughs> I don't really think having the time limit where your power is active really does much for the game. It just makes certain parts a little more annoying. Oh. What was it doing? You okay, Chuko? Chill! It's no big deal! Nothing bad has ever happened from me getting bit during this game. Is what I want to say, but I think walking is gonna be tough. Pep squeak. Uh, hey, Totsun! Stick with Chuko, would ya? I'm gonna go hit everything ahead of us with my bat. I'm gonna go get the key by myself. Are you sure? Quit stressing. I'll be fine. Sorry, Kansai. Do it for Yuki, okay? Hey, you don't need to remind me. But Chuko, I'm not just getting the key for Yuki's sake, okay? Chuko? I'm doing this for you, too. Huh? If the world doesn't get back to normal, you'll be upset, right? Actually, I'm gonna be way more upset. Because if that happens, if that happens, then I won't be able to build a bright future with you. <gasps> Wait a sec! What do you mean? <sighs> Later! Tatsun, save us. <laughs> He's joking, right? The big joke! They're gone. <laughs> They're gone, it's just me and my feelings. Can't say it his feelings. Yeah, this is, this is kind of an over overpowered one, isn't it? What the? Whoa, that one is freaking huge. Apparently, they eat more than, uh, mangoes. That was mangoes, right? Yeah, it was mangoes. Alright, oh hey, a ship! <laughs> it just sunk. It's, it's fine. Fine, it's, it's a flavor for the amusement park, is what it is. And console key green. Let's check these keys. Blue key. 
Green key. One more item to go. Yeah! There it is! Got the key! Look! I found it! The key to the bright future we're gonna build together. Kansai! Juko. Tatsun's here too. <laughs> classic, classic Tatsune. Yeah, that effect is never gonna is never gonna make it through. I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> Compression is going to murder that. All right, here we go. Consequences. Okay. I got it. Here goes nothing. Okay, here goes nothing. Oh, hold on. He's going to talk to me. Hey, can you hear me? You can see me, right? You've helped me out so many times up until now. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Can you help me this one last time? Protecting Yuki, erasing Mike. Restoring humanity's emotions. Those are our goals. The only one capable of saving the world is you. So I'm asking you, please, one last time. <laughs> right. Okay, for starters, gotta get closer to Mike. 
makes sense. Oh. Some kind of there are these floating cube thingies part of Mike's defense system. Oh dear. It's gonna launch a nasty attack. I've gotta be careful. I can't focus on everything that's happening on screen right now. <laughs> if you also pop up a text box. Okay. Okay. Huh? This console. All right. There's an input panel attached to it. Let's see if I can access the system through it. Let's find out. Oops. No time for that, apparently. <laughs> One of the things that I feel this game never really, like, properly, Could it be? um, it never really po properly followed up on was, uh, the different art styles of the various monsters that we saw. Like, it turned out, okay, Mike is, uh, Mike was projecting them, they were hallucinations, but that's kind of like only part of an answer. It, that, it, that's the how, but not really the why. Okay, oh boy. Does not want me to go activate that other console. Okay, the, the monkey butterfly box is a real pain. this time. Ah, just the other tentacle. I knew it. All right. I think that route will take me closer to Mike. So let's do that. Another issue I've had with the game, especially as uh, we come to this finale, this seems like a good place to just sort of like drop my last complaints. Um, oh, these things just make mud. That's no good. Probably slows you way down. Yeah, it gets you trapped by uh by the qu the quick boxes. Um, the the multiple timelines thing didn't like uh, much more than any other of uh, the uh, Uchikoshi games that I've played. Uh, it really felt like extraneous. It it didn't didn't really add like anything to uh, the goings on that really couldn't have been done uh, without it just being like a single timeline. Like if uh, kind of if you just uh, changed the order of events a little teensy bit and like got rid of the the whole uh, otherworlder stuff. It probably would have been fine. I don't want to just offer up uh, corrections to the game as if I definitely know better, but it def it really didn't feel like uh, it did much. Like, um, I the Somnium Files is probably a good example because there was it, it also had like a really light touch on the. Uh, the branching timeline stuff, but also the, uh, okay. Also the different timelines in that, like, were so really starkly different in a way that they really weren't here. And I really, I, I enjoyed like finding out exactly why they were so different. Like what, what changed, what didn't, uh, was uh, left 
quite unclear until most of the way through that game, and I thought the reveal was actually uh, very, very satisfying. Um, I cannot... Zero Escape, obviously, is just insane, and it's just, like, timelines uh, everywhere. Just non-stop timelines up the ass. Um, I have not... I, I did not play Punchline. I saw a couple episodes of the anime, and it was not for me. But that was before I had ever played 999 or any of those, so I'll probably revisit it at some point. Uh, am I missing... S I'm... Am I missing something, or is there not a path? Oh, there's the path. I'm sorry, I was talking. <laughs> so yeah, there's there's that. Overall, though, I did quite enjoy my time playing this. Um, it is very silly. The characters are mostly, like, they're fun, but perhaps, uh, they, the, uh, shoehorning, the, the, um, the, the Zodiac thing was perhaps adhered to a little too strongly, because a few of them really don't feel, didn't really feel like they did, did anything to the story, like, uh, Mochan's probably the worst example. He had no connection to anyone except he was horny for Nyoro. Whoops. All right. Did not jump in time. He he was horny for Nyoro, and that's like kind of it. And he ate he eats things. It's like uh, Shuko Kansai and Genu were all connected through um through uh uh. Oh, what was his name? Neon. I keep wanting to call him Aniki, but obviously that's not a thing. Um, they were connected through Neon. They all had like a, a personal connection. Chico a little bit because she like watched. Uh, she would watch uh, Kansai's baseball games. So th those three all kind of had a tie-in, which uh, he did end up sort of like being a, a key example of the state of the world. So that all works out pretty good. Um, oh, jeez. Let's see. Uh, Vanilla and Aniki, of course. We're siblings and... Uh, sort of the general mascots of the club. Um, but, uh, let's see, Pi, bo both through her weird uh, connection with Aniki and also just being able to see Vanilla in the first place, uh, she, she, uh, she had more than a few moments. I'm going to die. This is kind of hard, actually. This, is, this suddenly got difficult. Especially trying to talk through it. Um, let's see. Yuki obviously is connected to the whole thing. Uh, Nyoro is the, the daughter of a scientist, and that's very important. I, I every time my I, my brain pulls up a list of the Go-Getters Club. I'm always forgetting somebody. Let's just hop on in there. Just make sure. Pochi is a robot. Next type robot. Which I I feel like um, giving one of your robots the ability to talk to other worlders who can see other timelines is not like a great idea. Uh, Tatsun also kind of super disconnected from everything. But it was he was pretty funny when when he turned into Electro Ranger Black, so I'll accept it. Pochi, Racho, and Yuki, of course, are all like in on it in some way. And uh, yeah, that's that's everyone. Didn't really. Whoa.
the stuff with the the cult leader master kind of like after after the first encounter with him he kind of just it's he just exists after that really the the whole cult is just kind of uh it's just there it's just a detail that we had to walk through Left is better in this case, okay. A, a thing with the branching timelines, which I, I feel like I, I've probably brought up, is it really feels like there's a right answer and a wrong answer for each of the major branches. With one of them being like much shorter and less uh, less satisfying overall. Oh, that's a lot of hands. Can't get through the opposite way. Well, take this, I guess. There we go. That's better. All right. Nice. They're so floppy. Huh? I can see the bar going up. just what some simulation says, right? That's right. But my simulations are flawless. You think so? Then why didn't you predict this would happen? A simulation like that doesn't prove anything. <sighs> you can't predict the future of humanity, however good your simulations are. Because humans have these completely illogical things called emotions. What I realized spending time with the go-getters is that emotions are wonderful. Laughing so hard with your friends that your stomach hurts. Crying so much that you can hardly breathe. Those moments are so precious. Nothing can replace them. That's why I'm going to keep protecting humanity's emotions here on out.
Bochi? Bochi. <gasps> oh. 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 Yay, we're going to do the weird dance one last time. By the way, how's Yuki? Safe and sound as you can see. Thanks to you guys. Oh. That's a relief. She woke up before you got back. She says her memories and emotions are all fine. She would, though. Mr. Pochi. Mr. Pochi? Hyper, mega, super, duper, pippity, poppity, thank you! I don't think I'm ever getting that badge back. Damn right you're not. Plus, Vanilla is back with us. And we managed to save Yuki! On top of that, Mike is destroyed! Humans have gotten their emotions back. Uh, pr probably. Everything is all taken care of now. Thank you so much, Pochi. I'll give you a kiss later to say thanks. Mochan's frozen up again. <laughs> huh? What's wrong, Pochi? Oh no, he's looking at me again. You look kind of troubled. Um, well, it's just that Vanilla said everything was all sorted. But there's one thing we're missing, right? There's 12 go-getters in total, but there's only 11 of us here. Oh. 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 It's okay. I'm here. doing here what am i doing here isn't it obvious like like even if this world comes to an end the go-getters club will never fall apart right Adventures about to begin. Twelve boys and girls, go, go, go getters. Fate brought us together. And when we all work as one, we're the toughest thing around. Things aren't easy, there's no doubt. But you'll never ever be alone. Been there from the start. Even if the world comes to an end, go, 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 getters. 
fiery maiden blazing through the dark. Ride the wind and jump into the fray. Grand Slammer hit it out of the park. Fully awakened, nothing can defeat us. Dressed up in black, a sparking superhero. Steely Chef, he is here to lead the way. Raging power, the grass shakes below. We will never give up on our dreams. Twelve boys and girls, go, go, go getters. So, so far from home. But no matter how far we roam, our bond is unbreakable. Our goal is distant, our hearts grow numb. But our friends are there to keep us strong. Out here on the high seas, my poor heart flutters around. Love so strong it hurts, set my heart free. Chuko Mojan, Vanilla Tatsun, Koji Painyoro, Kansai Anikiki, Jenu. Thank you. This was all down to you. Thanks to you, we saved Vanilla, Yuki, and even Rachel. Defeating Mike and restoring humanity's emotions, that was all you. Everything, everything is thanks to you. The world will slowly go back to normal. And us go-getters will grow up, little by little. Before long, we'll be adults. But whatever happens, however much time passes, one thing will never change. That's you and me. We'll be friends forever. Friends for eternity. At the world's end.
All right, I obtained the Go Getters Club theme song. Okay, are we done? I believe. Yes. All right, that's it. World's End Club is complete. As I said, uh, like I, I kind of followed it up with like endless complaints because it's it's easier to talk about the things that you don't like than the things that you do like. It's just kind of how it is. Overall, I did really enjoy this thing. Um, it is, it is there's something about uh, the Kotaro Uchikoshi games, the the way he writes. Uh, obviously, it's through a translator. Um, but the sort of the the general flow of the dialogue and scenes just kind of there there's something really compelling about specifically the way that he does that and i'm i'm not really sure what it is but i'm kind of just always up for it like it's it's a a certain blend of uh serious and nonsense that just i i've always, i i just always feel like it flows really well even when the dialogue itself is not necessarily the best, it's just, it's always, it's always just like pretty compelling to just sit through. And I also always uh, really like when, when uh, story-based games just include like uh, pictures of the post, uh, the post-game world during the end credits instead of like having a whole scene at the end. It just, it says everything that you really need to know. It's just everything's getting better again, and we'll, uh, we're always, everything's, it, <laughs> they'll all be okay. Let's see, if I go into gallery, up into art here, let's just, uh, check it out. Ending, all right, I got all of these, all of these shots here. Can I, hold up. Can I make the... It did disappear for like a second there. I, I was, I'm trying to make the... Uh... The interface go away, but it's not doing that. There it goes. Okay, I just need to stop touching things. This is a fun, this is a fun little image. All of these are really good. The... 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 the uh... The full screen art in this game, like pretty much all of it, was uh, fantastic. <laughs> Yuki, of course, doing the dangerous surgery. Being helped by her rats. And there's the club. Back together at last. Uh, another one I really liked, which popped up during the the ending, I just want to point out specifically this shot here. Just Rachel going grrr and about to to hurl the bomb. I don't know why that one really works for me, but uh, it does. It does. See, so yeah, I got all the music now. Many many music tracks. Also very good music in this, uh, especially, um, I know some of them changed for, uh, uh, for the final release. Like there was an early version in the previous one that, uh, got modified. I believe this is one of them. Yeah. And pretty much all of the ones where I've heard both, uh, the new one for the Switch release, uh, it's just better. So they, they were, they were clearly still working on it in that span of time it wasn't just like we're done here's not even two-thirds of the game this is like 85 percent of it and we'll just wait for the rest uh, like there, there was still more work to be done i don't i still don't understand why they split it up though like i don't think i i don't think that helped this at all there we go got all the movies I'll never forget. I think, okay, I think this is actually the end credits for the Apple Arcade release. Let me just uh, check this out. I keep calling it Apple Arcade and Switch, even though it's all on, uh, it's all on uh, both now. <laughs> it's 
also that that last bit where Rachel was talking, um, I I did notice that uh, Rachel had a voice actor listed on the main uh, page or on the the web page for this game. So that that wasn't really that big of a surprise. I'm sorry. Okay, you know what? There is one thing I want to check out before we go. Just want to see. True ending. Difficulty normal. I just want to see what happens if I do one stupid thing. Let's see. Leave. It's here and where's vanilla? Just gonna skip on ahead. Skip event. Please don't skip this entire scene. Uh. Don't skip. Okay, yeah, it's gonna be after this. Skip on ahead. And Pochi's gonna turn to the camera and be like, hey, you. You, otherworlder. Do I wanna skip it? Yes. Uh, All right, do do I help Pochi? Let's, uh, let's listen to the dialogue, actually. Let's listen to the boy beg for help. Please, you've got to help us. You're the only one who can help us, Otherworlder. Nah. Hey, why aren't you saying anything? I'm asking you, we need your help. Nah. Hey, why aren't you saying anything? I'm asking you. I'm giving it one more. <laughs> I'm asking you. Okay. 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 We're uh we're good here. Uh skip event. Yep. Help. Yeah, fine. Okay. Well, this is just going to be a long way around it. So I'm just going to close out entirely. I'm going to hop all right back on in. Uh, I'm, uh, and uh, run the other credits and just, just see how those look. But I am done with this game. Thank you for watching through all of this. And uh, make sure to, uh, you know, well, if you feel like it, just uh, you should uh, probably like pick up this game and, you know, check out some other stuff from uh, from old Tokyo games. Uh, probably the best thing that they've put out so far is not actually a game. It's, uh, the anime Akudama Drive, which is a trip. <laughs> it's re- it's re that's really something, and you should definitely at least take a look at that. And, uh, there's also the FMV game Death Come True, which is weird and short. Uh, it's very much, uh, leaning to the movie part of interactive movie. Um, I enjoyed my time with it. It's it, it's uh, hard to describe without spoilers. 
But uh, that was a fun little thing. And um, no, uh, the only other game that they have announced currently officially is like a mobile thing, which may or may not be worthwhile. I don't really know much about it. Uh, also, on the on the Uchikoshi front, uh, there is a sequel to I, The Somnium Files, which is supposedly due out early next year. Uh, I, The Somnium Files, uh, the Nir er, Nirvana Initiative, I believe it was, which is, uh, it should have just been called I, The Nirvana Initiative, but I guess uh, they could only trademark the whole title uh, with The Somnium Files. So they just have to go with the awkward one. But yeah, that's uh, there we go. World's End Club has ended, and I will never forget. Thanks so much. <laughs> what does that? do with anything for everything you guys deal with him how all right everyone let's go then why i have no regrets you're that's right my name is mike what about the meteor we all saw from the bus i'd be taken in like that exactly you have been chosen so with the vanilla we can see us i'm going to tell you the truth you're kidding me what the hell's going on? Sorry, everyone. What? What? No, Bochi! Don't you dare! Guys, the fight isn't over yet. It's okay. I'm here.